Look at this thing. Good morning, sweet Seattle. Got ourselves all packed up. Phone is still dinging. That doesn't change ever. That's okay. I like it. People want to talk to me. Make me feel good in the morning. So my flight leaves at 11.30. It's about 9.15 right now. I'm running a little bit late, but my Uber's on the way here. I'm gonna hop in the back. We're gonna take off down to the airport. I'm gonna check myself in, go through all the security checks, all that fun stuff. We'll be on the way. There's a stop off in Salt Lake City on the way home. And from there, it's a straight shot home. No, wait, no, from Salt Lake City, we fly to Minneapolis. And then from Minneapolis to home. You ready for this? Get your game face on! So I'm in my friend's truck right now. They came to pick me up from the airport and I'm gonna be spending some time here in Salt Lake City. This summer, make the most of the season with the Jeep brand's legendary off-road capability. Cherish every thousand dollars bonus cash at the Jeep summer clearance event. Right now, get 3250 total cash allowance on 2015. Some of my friends like cats. They got lots of cats in their house. <laughs> I think they got like three or four cats. I'm just sitting here watching some TV with that guy. This is the basement where I'll be staying. Got some mattresses right down there. I know there hasn't been too much of a vlog today, guys. I'm sorry about that. It's been sort of me trying to get here, the flight, and the whole process of actually getting here was just took a little longer than I thought today. And when I got here, we were catching up for the longest time. We played some Harry Potter uh, Clue. It's like the game Clue, except it's... Harry Potter figurines, it's hard to explain. I left a thing on Snapchat, if you follow me there, you would have seen it. We went out to Cold Stone Creamery, is that what it's called? Got ourselves some ice cream after supper and whatnot. And just sort of just been hanging out all day and whatnot. And I was gonna stay in a motel in uh, the city here. And they're like, oh no, no, you know what? Just why don't you just stay in the basement? Save some money, so uh, I really do appreciate that. So that was a big favor of them to do for me when they didn't really have to do that, so. No, it's, it's always good to have good friends, you know. I made some good friends in Seattle, and I got to hang out with some good friends here in Utah, and then head back home and go back to work. But we did go to these things called Red Box. Have you guys heard of these things before? It's like a vending machine for movies. We rented the movie Insurgent. So we're going to watch that tonight yet, and then get a good night's sleep, and then tomorrow we might be going to the amusement park in Utah. You're going to want to tune in for that because that's going to be a great vlog. Much better than today. I'll let you know tomorrow if we're going to go and hopefully I think we're going to go. Insurgent was such a good movie. And I love those series. I love the Divergent Insurgent series. I also like the Mockingjay series. They're very similar in my mind. But Got my bed all set up here. My laptop out. It's time to edit yesterday's vlog that you watched yesterday. I'm quieter now because they're sleeping. And I'm up here by myself because I still gotta work. Hoping that we can explore a little bit around here tomorrow. It should be a lot of fun. 
hit that subscribe button, that like button, guys. And I know this vlog wasn't up to par with my regular schedule, but I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, you beautiful people. It's another new day. I'm in Salt Lake City. I'm just at my friend's house. We're gonna head out to the amusement park in town today and go on some rides. You go upside down a lot and I might lose my camera. They might not let me take you guys on the rides. But I have to. I have to take you guys on the rides. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm wearing shorts right now, you see this? I'm thinking maybe putting my jeans back on because they have tighter pockets. And then I put you guys in my pockets and you guys won't fall out. I do have this wrist strap. My friend here plays the piano. There's a bison on the road here, Antelope Island. That thing is huge. Look at this thing. It's huge. So he's just gonna go say hi to his little buddy over there. It's probably a statue of him, you know? Probably, yeah, it still looks good. It still looks good, it looks like me. Maybe he thought it was a friend and now he's all disappointed. What's he doing? He's marking his territory. Oh, he's marking his territory. <laughs> that is his woman. That's a guy, though. <laughs> oh my. Okay. This is, uh, what we do. So we're here on Antelope Island. The amusement park was closed today, so that was disappointing. So we came here, and apparently they got lots of bison. Bison. Bison, bison, buffalo. So Antelope Island is right on Salt Lake, the Great Salt Lake. It smells like dead fish here. I wanted to come here and see the bison. Where'd he go? There he goes. Where is he? There he is. Just a beast. There's a whole bunch of them here too. I'm really looking forward to those water rides at the amusement park because it's so hot today. It's like 100 degrees. It's oh, 36 so degrees Celsius. I was thinking of going swimming later. I don't have my waterproof camera though, so you guys won't be able to come. But I'll show you the pool. Oh, we got more people coming up behind us taking pictures. <laughs> We're in the way of them taking a picture of this monument. did get to go see bison, but the park was closed. Oh, yeah, so we were gonna go to that lagoon amusement park today. They're closed during the week. They're only open Saturdays and Sundays. What? So yeah, I'm disappointed. So we drove out to uh, Antelope Island. That's where that bison was. Bison? I was told I'm saying bison wrong. I say everything wrong. And uh, we saw the buffalo there. And also the salt lake. It smells like dead fish near Salt Lake, not gonna lie. It's tank. <laughs> but we might be going swimming later on today. We don't know. I'm sort of just hanging out, hanging around here, spending time with the friends and stuff. And then I'll be flying out of here tomorrow afternoon. I'm sort of hoping we go swimming later. <laughs> I could really use a dip in the, it's like a hundred, over a hundred degrees here today. I wanted to point out that I'm watching a 1986 VHS movie. Yes, they still exist. This plane features Wi-Fi and internet access will be available while we're above 10,000 feet. Activate internet. Scroll, scroll, favorite. Now, before we take off, be sure your seat is upright.
Chinese food and a Gatorade. But it can't get too much better than that. And we made it home. Back at mom and dad's. Thanks mom for coming to pick me up. You're welcome. Yeah. Late at night, it's almost well, 20 to one in the morning. Yeah. I'm gonna stay here for the night. It still feels like home staying at mom and dad's. <laughs> <laughs> it always will. <laughs> yeah. This picture over here is actually a picture of my dad's house where he grew up in, uh, he grew up in Paraguay in South America. He came to Canada when he was 14, I think. But my grandparents were born in Canada, so they left Canada, had my dad out there, and then came back. And then this handsome guy here, I don't know who he is. But yeah, summer fun is over. Time to get back to work. Mom put in this new backsplash in her kitchen. What do you guys think of it? Where can I show you it? Here it is over here. It's very nice, eh? They just gotta finish this plug here yet, but... Very nice. Their house is always so clean. I don't know how she does it. It's like spotless, like... Not a speck of dust anywhere, look at this. Not a speck of dust anywhere. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> How do you keep it so clean? Clean up after myself right away. Very easy. Very easy. Married me in my truck. <laughs>